Madame Fu was the first speaker at the debate. Maybe we are at the doorstep again of choices. Are we going to continue the path of building trust, having cooperation, resolving differences, which has been proven correct over the past decades, or are you? Are we going to be riven and fractured uh, again uh, by enlarged differences? Uh, the option, the, the thinking on the Chinese side, as uh, President Xi Jinping recently said, stated at the CICA summit in Shanghai that uh, uh, China would like to see a new security approach in Asia. Mm -hmm. During the discussions, the U.S. representative stressed several times that the U.S. is against unilateral changes of the status quo. Fu spoke of China's position on this issue. We should uh, uh, restrain any unilateral uh, change of, uh, of uh, status quo, unilateral provocations. And there have been the, this kind of developments, and China has confronted with uh, some difficult challenges. Uh, the, the, the position on the Chinese side is that when we are confronted, for example, when the Philippines send their Navy, naval vessel to harass fishermen, when the Japanese government decided to nationalize the the so-called nationalized Diaoyu Island. In the final uh, analysis, I think uh, it's very important to come back to dialogue, mm -hmm. come back to negotiations. Fu said although most people claimed that they were for cooperation and dialogue, words were much easier exchanged than actions. For the aligned relationship between U.S. Is and its allies, I think for China, the alignment of the United States is a, is a, a leftover from the Cold War. There was a meaning during the Cold War. And now the observing point for China is the nature of the alignment. If the allies of the U.S. take China as uh, on the opposing side, then China would be concerned. And if U.S. use uh, frictions or, or or problems between China and its, its neighbors to, to strengthen the alignment, it will be another question mark on the Chinese side too. And that's one of the reasons that China and U.S. really need to have a very direct discussions and direct talks and to understand each other. Yeah, I'm speaking from Experts and scholars from many other countries also joined the debate. The Shangri-La Dialogue was organized by the London-based think tank International Institute for Strategic Studies. It has become one of the key events for defense professionals in the region to exchange views on security issues. Hu Chuqiao, CCTV.